hello and welcome back to the new video the java tutorial series so this is a continuation uh, continued video to the exercise that we have uh, started in the started in our previous video uh, so we have to solve the two problems java inheritance 1 and java inheritance 2 in our previous video so in this video we will be talking about uh, abstract class java in interface and java method overriding problem okay so for the first problem java abstract class uh, abstract class uh, is a uh, okay this is this is the formal definition of the abstract class you read it we have also done it in our previous video okay the following is an example of the abstract class uh, so they have given one example for the abstract class okay and if you try to create an instance of this class like the following uh, you will get an error okay okay so uh, now you have to create another class that extends the abstract class then you can create the instance of the new class and notice that set title method is abstract too and has no body okay uh, set title is abstract and has no body okay and that means you must implement that body of the method inside the child class okay we have to implement this in the editor we have provided an abstract class book and main class in the main class we create an instance of the class called my book and your task is to just write the my book class okay uh, sample input is a tail of the two cities and the sample output is a title is a tail of the two cities okay so I got some idea okay and let me get into my idea I will create a new class okay Java exercise problem 3 okay let me increase the font size I will put my main method now okay so they have created the abstract class book okay so we have to create one abstract class book okay so abstract class book and inside that uh, one string for holding the title of the book title and then one abstract method as they have said abstract void set title okay and one it it accepting one string parameter yes okay abstract class we have written and we will write one st sorry string get title for receiving the title and inside this we will simply write return sorry not capital return the title okay so we are returning the title over here and wait a minute one small typo is okay now it's okay uh, we'll write another class name as book so class not book my book uh, which extends this book class inside this uh, we have to give the implementation of the set title method so over here I will write public set title and I will pass the parameter as string title okay set uh, title I am getting error you can require type or oh, must be declared after okay now we are implementing that okay the return time should be there now void set title okay now it's okay and this dot title is equals to title mm, okay this is about the set title method now inside my main method I will create the object of the my book class opg is equals to new opg my book and I will call this method 
obj dot set title and I will simply first receive the title from the user for that I have to declare one string variable title title initially it is empty string and after that uh, I will receive the input from the user for receiving the input I have to create one object of the scanner class scanner sc is equals to new scanner system dot in okay now I will set the title value to sc dot next now it's okay and I will pass that title to this method okay um, okay and uh, what it's returning get title okay uh, so we have to get this method also now to receive this method I will just simply copy this method and will print it over here get title and I will simply call one sprint statement and inside this print statement I will write obj dot get title okay and before that I will concat it with one string that is the title of the book is this okay now if I run this first it will ask me for the title of the book okay so what they have given to us the title the tale of the two cities I will simply copy it and I will paste it over here and enter a title of the book is a object oh, wait a minute wait a minute what am I missing over here the title of the book is a oh wait 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 next next line it should be now if I run it again and I will give it the same now it's okay so the error was in this one uh, if you write next it will get only uh, the one word uh, first word and uh, whenever it receives the space it will just s ignore that part uh, to get that whole string uh, you have to write a c dot next line okay so now you are, here you can see we are mm, giving one input as a title of the notebook uh, sorry no, not notebook book and we are receiving the title of the book is a tale of the two cities okay so that is the part that we have to do okay right moving forward to the next one uh, java interfaces uh, and okay so what they have given is uh, this is the overview of this uh, whole problem uh, java interface can contain only uh, signature and the fields one okay so you read it i have read already you just pause the video and read it so what we have to do is here you can see you are given with the interface advanced arithmetic which contains a method signature okay int divisor sum and you need to write a class called my calculator which implements the interface okay we have to implement the interface and the divider sum function just takes an integer as an input and return the sum of all its divisor okay so so uh, the divisor of 6 are 1 2 3 and 6 and the sum of the divisors are 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 6 is equal to 12 so we have to return this okay and to do so oh, we have given over here and read the partially completed code in the editor complete it okay so let me create one class name as advance arithmetic okay mm, sorry for comment okay and I will import my main method I will get it over here and I have to write one uh, this 
what we can say interface uh, I guess they have written interface already okay I will just copy this interface from here and I will paste it over here okay wait I is not getting it now it's okay uh, let me format it So over here I have co copied this interface so from here and now uh, inside my arithmetic uh, advanced arithmetics class uh, I need to implement I guess that one okay so I will write public int uh, let me just copy this part name of the method which accepting the parameter of integer n and inside this I will write int I need one variable known as sum 0 I will initialize with and I will inside my for loop I will it will start from int d is equals to 1 whenever d is less than n and each time I will be doing d plus plus okay and inside this for loop I will check if that n in mod d equals equals to 0 if it's so sum is equals to sum plus is equals to d okay and after that uh, after running the for loop i will just simply return this sum okay uh, so this is uh, pretty much that we have to okay 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 wait 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 why it's throwing the error let me check okay uh, class advanced arithmetics is public and should be declared inside the ad advanced arithmetics dot java okay 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 wait I know the error now it's okay the file name and the class name is different that's why the IntelliJ ID is throwing the errors okay and inside the main method uh, I will just create the object of this class and using that object I will just call d with the sum and I will pass the same value that they have given okay so they have given 6 as an input so let me give it also 6 as an input and I will pass it and this method is returning the sum so i have to write this whole thing inside one print statement so that the return value can be printed on the console okay so if i right click and uh, click on run the 12 should be get yeah 12 12 is printing on the console so this problem is also s s done okay so I hope you, you can solve these uh, remaining problems uh, if I I can solve also so I want you to solve just give it a try try to solve these uh, questions uh, go, check out the discussion forum if you got stuck anywhere in between uh, check out the leaderboard uh, submissions your previous submission should become here and edit editorial will be open uh, don't open the editorial you will see the answer directly uh, first try to answer these questions try to get the solution and i hope uh, you enjoyed this exercise and thank you for watching this video and i will see you in the next one